Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is John and this is your Modern Tech Breakdown. Today I'm taking a look at a zero day vulnerability in Firefox, Tor Browser, and Thunderbird. Let's jump into it. So here we have an article from Security Week outlining the critical vulnerability found in the Firefox browser. Unfortunately, it seems like this vulnerability has been exploited in the wild and it appears that it was found in the browser's animation timeline code where an attacker can achieve remote code execution by exploiting a use after free vulnerability. So this is pretty severe. The good news is that Firefox has already patched this vulnerability last week. However, not everyone is up to date on the latest patches as soon as they roll out. So if you or anyone in your organization is running Firefox, it's extremely important that they update to 13.0.2 or newer. It's worth noting that Mozilla's Thunderbird email client is also affected by this vulnerability, so you'll want to update any of those installs to the latest version as well. But probably even less used than the Thunderbird email client is the Tor browser that will also need to be updated to the latest version, but I'm guessing not a lot of people use that. So how bad is the vulnerability? Well, the article doesn't really get into the details. It seems like Mozilla is being tight-lipped about it, but it seems pretty bad because it takes advantage of the animation timeline and it would seem that simply loading a malicious link that uses those animation features would probably be enough for an attacker to achieve remote code execution, which is pretty much the means for an attacker to own your machine. So yeah, pretty bad. So get on updating your software. Uh, according to this article, this is the first exploited zero day for Firefox in 2024. They made it all the way to October, which is honestly a pretty good track record. So kudos to Mozilla. Uh, but as I said, this is a pretty severe vulnerability. So update your Firefox installs. With that, I'll leave it there. As always, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you next time.